fun entertainment news today. Um, if you haven't gotten enough of Avengers Endgame, they mm -hmm. should have called it Endish Game. Yeah. <laughs> because no they're re-releasing no it. No Endgame. They're re-releasing it to try to beat Avatar's record of being Smart. the number one grossing movie of all, all time. time. Just to let you know, um, Endgame sits right now at about $2.743 billion. Avatar leads with $2.788 billion. So that's about what's, 45, what's 45 million, million between bucks. friends. You know, well, it's when you say between friends, what's I interesting about the story is they're actually competing against themselves because since Disney bought Fox, same company. it's the same, same company. company. So, you know, the bragging rights are all internal. But if you're hoping that it's going to be an extended... Well, there's also, you want that ability to say it's the number one movie of all time. I wonder if it'll work, though. Absolutely. Well, I mean, people can't seem to get enough of this. It's already three hours long. I don't know how much they've added to it, but again, it's Apparently, not extended isn't it post credits scenes. or something it like is that, rushed. right? So they yeah. can be adding post credits. So there's nothing more in terms of scenes, in terms of plot. Can I say something though? Through. As yes. much as I love Endgame, uh, I loved Avatar more. Really? I'm saying Do you know what? I've never seen it. Avatar. Oh well, that's on your list. You have to watch I need it. to there's give you a list. Amazing environmental message. Oh, it's, it's incredible. Beautifully it, shot and I, done. I missed it in the theaters, and I almost feel like that's a movie you want to see in the theaters. You gotta watch it. You know, Avatar came out. Um, if anybody remembers, when 3D was kind of everywhere, yep. and it was one of the few movies that actually worked really well in 3D mm. because of the environment, because of the blues, and because James Cameron is a genius. Yes. yes. Um, I will say this, it is absolutely worth a watch. And don't forget, we're now going to have like four or five more avatars coming down the pipe. Yeah, yeah, they have sequels right. in the works. They should yeah. re release the original avatar in theaters and then oh, just steamroll oh, oh, Avengers Endgame. But do them at the same time in this little contest. Yeah. Oh, who wants okay, to see my what? We were just talking about Keanu Reeves having such a hot year between uh, John Wick 3. Yep. Uh, always Toy be Story, your maybe. Kaboom, always be always my maybe. And uh, Duke Kaboom in Toy Story, and Toy Story 4. Yeah. And now he's sought well, after again. And now, I mean, it's just an incredible story. According to Kevin Feige, who runs all of MCU, he is the mastermind between behind these decades of movies of MCU. He said they've gone after Keanu Reeves for every single MCU movie. Wow. That they want him as a superhero in the MCU, in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And he said, no. Why? Every Which single. speaks volumes to the power of Pixar and Disney that he said yes to Duke Kaboom, yep. the super Canadian superhero. Uh, what is he? He's, a, he's like an evil he's a, Knievel a, character. He's like, a a yeah, yeah, exactly. he's like yeah. evil Daredevil. Knievel. So he did say yes to Disney and Pixar, but he said no to Marvel. But Kevin Feige has said he's not given up after all. Keanu Reeves is the internet's boyfriend. And you know what? I wonder why. Is it because he doesn't want to get caught up in the RDJ he, fame and have, of having to do one after another because he already but, did The Matrix? And but he's done The Matrix and Speed. I mean, John maybe Wick. he just wants a break. Know. He, know, he knows what a movie franchise requires, yeah. right? He's got lots of history with The Matrix and John Wick. And maybe he's, I mean, How? he's not a spring chicken anymore. And he has How about a hundreds villain? of millions. I could see him. He, I, I think don't want Keanu Can as a villain. No, me neither. I think I he has Kano that ability to go in different directions as an artist and expand his horizons. Keanu's my hero, Roger. I love Keanu. I still Remember love him he, as, a, as a villain. I would still love him. Remember well, when he was on the plane? Like, there's all these things about Keanu on the internet and the memes that have come yeah. around when he was on. Because he's sad just such Keanu. a good sad Keanu eating the sandwich in New York. Offering his seat on the subway, subway to a lady. Keanu. You do remember. I'm so impressed. There was also when his plane had to take an emergency landing. It was going from San Francisco to Los Angeles. And he had an emergency landing. And he just got a shuttle for everybody and got on the bus and rode the bus with everybody. Did he also yep. give a massive anonymous donation, which he came does out that years regularly. Later? Yeah. Yeah. He, yeah, he, he donates millions regularly. and millions of dollars to yeah. charities. Right. And then someone leaks it years yeah. later. Yeah, yeah. And he, yeah, it's all anonymous when he does it. Um, Keanu Reeves has one of these, and now Drake does. Can you guess what it is? <gasps> Tens of millions notes. of dollars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. A large bank yeah. account. <laughs> you know, uh, something you made else. it when. Madame Tussauds makes, oh. a, makes a wax figure of you. Sometimes they're harrowing, let's yep. be honest. Yeah. They're not always good, but this one's pretty good. It's oh, here in a hot line playing environment. That's right, uh, bang on, actually. Yeah. yeah. That's anyway, cool. Drakey. Looks like he's about to call us on the cell phone. Hey! hey. You went there. Okay, Tara coming out. Toy Story 4, Annie Potts is back as Bo Peep. Yeah. We awesome. talk about that and some Duke Kaboom. Okay, very cute. Beautiful. Duke Kaboom! Duke Kaboom! And yes, Toy Story 4 in theaters today. Check it out. You'll love it. Right now, over to Mel in the newsroom.